Welcome to another edition of JavaScript for You. This morning we're going to take a look at the data function in jQuery. And this is a fairly simple function. What you do is you use a selector to grab an object. In this case I'm grabbing the div on this page. You notice this div doesn't have anything in it. And I'm going to attach some data to it. So I'm going to stuff a greeting into it. That's the ID. So the key for it. And there's the value. So it just allows you to put basically a dictionary on a page. So if you wanted to download some data to a page in order to have it accessible to other JavaScript functions, this would be one way to do it. And then later on, I can do something by clicking the button and grab the data I attached to it. So again, key value pair, I could query it later and get the data I'd asked for. So for instance, something like a list of state capitals or state names, something like that, you could throw that down to a page and then have it dynamically fill some element on the page instead of having to query back in for it. So let's see how that works. Let's go ahead and open this up. So I'll bring up my finder over here. I'll find my JavaScript here. And there I press this to attach. Let's go and retrieve it first. Notice it says null. There's nothing attached to that div now. Let's go ahead and press the attach. Now we'll retrieve again. And there it is. It keyed in by looking for the greeting. So you see here, got the key, and then it got the value. And that's really all there is to it. So, until next time, have fun with JavaScript.